this is a bit of an interesting question. I have a student from within our Telegram group who's asking about how to study histology for step one. Holy shit. Okay, I mean, we discuss the notion of histology, uh, that it's not necessarily high yield, okay? So what do we do in terms of covering histo? Okay, is there any uh, important point you should know? Is there any specific resource uh, you should look at? Uh, and I can give you a very solid answer here. So before we get started, please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Give the video a like. I really appreciate it. Find me on Instagram at melman underscore medical, M-E-H-L, and man underscore medical. Link is down below. Find me on Telegram. The links to the Telegram group and channel are down below. Now I'll start the clip. So histo, okay, what are we going to do? Uh, the answer is no, I do not want you wasting your fucking time looking at random obscure histo resources. However, what I can briefly articulate is that you should know, and this is, I'm, we're getting specific right now. I'm driving to the point, okay? You should know alveolar histo. They like that. I literally want you to go on Google Images and just fucking look at alveoli, like the type 1, type 2 pneumocytes, alveolar macrophage, okay? So you need to know alveolar histo. Those questions have shown up. You need to know, and this is going to be really annoying, you do need to know gastric mucosa in terms of which is a parietal cell, which is a chief cell, and it's difficult to look at. But we're not talking about you going through a massive book where, where we're wasting your time, okay? It doesn't really extend beyond you spending six minutes Google imaging gastric mucosa, and you're like, okay, I think that's a parietal cell. I think that's a chief cell, okay? So the alveolar uh, surface area, the, like the alveolus, the gastric mucosa, and also adrenal histo, very important, okay? So... You split that adrenal gland, and you're gonna get, you're gonna have the capsule as the top layer, and then you're gonna have the three layers of the adrenal cortex: glomerulosa, fasciculata reticularis, and then your medulla. Okay, so they'll show you five letters A through E, and students get tripped up. They think the capsule is letter A is the glomerulosa. It's not. Okay, you need to know the capsule. So I just want you to Google image just just have an idea of your adrenal histo. Okay, you should know the uh, blood testes barrier, the Sertoli cells. Okay, so you're going to see most of the Sertoli cells, mostly linear fashion. You're going to see Leydig cells or interstitial cells. Okay, so I want you to be able to differentiate Sertoli from Leydig cell. And I want you to know uh, endometrial histo for the follicular slash proliferative phase versus the luteal slash secretory phases. Okay, as far as the tubular straight glands versus the coiled glands that with secretions in the lumina, okay? So you do need to know your histo for the endometrium. Notice I've given some specifics right now. We, we haven't really gone too broad, right? Because as I articulate at the start of the clip, going off and studying histo is a big waste of your fucking time, apart from just a few consolidated sources. Like, you, you don't need to... Uh, be looking at what is the spleen, how does the spleen look, how does the thymus look, as, as examples. Waste of fucking time, okay? So, and you're going to go through all the NVMe content because there's going to be occasional histo pics that show up. Uh, yes, you need to know prostatitis, pyelonephritis, okay? You're going to see lots of blue cells floating around on those slices, okay? That's also really important. Prostatitis, pyelonephritis, just knowing the blue cells are your neutrophilic infiltrate. Okay, um, so you're gonna you're gonna Google image as I've talked about in this clip for the various uh, organ systems, and then you're just going to go through the NBME content and take a reactive secondary approach. When you see an image, you say, "Okay, this was weird fucking histo. I'm learning this image, but it kind of ends there, and I don't need to waste my time apart from that." You know the deal. I'm gonna continue to make more content. If you like my stuff, subscribe to my channel, and I appreciate your time. That's it.